where the pitch it goes. Still working it through the hands back into Jamie. First shot and anger from about 30 metres out. He likes that one on white crew that are our commentary sponsors, Brendan Good, Curra Finman, and uh, glad to correct that one. Glad to have the ball in the hands of Garod Kelly, I'd imagine, there at the Curra Finman. Second shot at the post, second ball. Back it comes to Fionn Clancy, recycling it to Jamie Malone, setting the feet into Robin Mounsey. Can he get the strike away? Mounsey high, and Mounsey scores. Three shots at the post. That's exactly where he goes. Aaron's coming off the shoulder. He slips it to him. Martin Griffin setting the feet, trying to get back onto the right foot, angling it over the shoulder and putting it over the bar. When you've got two for Cal, ever busy, ever willing, and very, very clever ball indeed. Back around it comes to Garod Kelly. His second shot at the posts, and you can mark that one down as well. A bit of a slight breeze is picked up here in the park. The tricolour is blowing face when it's into the face, but here he goes. Oh, and Daverin with the free from the floor, and oh, it's going yes. exactly the same way as the young Griffin inside. Oh, busy from him, and he was behind the defender in that case. Defender went up, pammed the ball down around King Griffin, and here's the free kick. Fanukin will tap it over the bar, but more industrious from Lizzie. He is raiding down. He's got uh, Dear McCahill ahead of him. That's exactly where the ball goes. He's met there by Niall Kelly playing cornerback. Dear McCahill with the shot. This is incredible efficiency. If these get it into him, it's Arden Griffin that's taking it forward. Just didn't spot the run of Niall Kelly. Now he has. He'll have to pirouette around. Off on the loop they come. Oh, and yes. kicking a nice, tidy point there is Shane Griffin for on the board. Good tackle there from Matt Shea just to put him off his stride. But Dear McCahill tidies up the brakes. The dinger off the left and he has slotted it straight between the posts. That victory over the same opponent. Uh, two league wins and of course now this championship game here. Beautiful angle ball out to Shane Griffin turning, kicking over the shoulder and landing a brilliant, brilliant Shane O'Collins on that occasion. But the free goes the way of the Lissy Caseyman bearing down on goal. Cyril Sheehan, has he been pulled to the ground? He certainly has. Jamie Malone got back. Quick thinking to take the point who are just starting to bite back, Rory. Yeah, it's just heating up a small bit here in the park. Clancy on that occasion kind of slid in soccer style and uh, conceded the free. Stood around talking to the referee. Quick. We all yesterday. We came up a small bit short, but uh, that's, the, that's the way it is and that's here come Corifin once more more birthdays to come in between the football action as Sean O'Brien sticks that ball and his back up Jamie Malone has taken the free and Garrod Kelly is cantering into space on that right hand channel once again sending the ball goalwards he can do no wrong that's his third point on the board for him they'll need an awful lot more if they have to turn this one around is looping it back around there to Inda Finuc and back to Arden Griffin once again this time off the Lovely. left that's a tidy tidy finish Aaron 50 metres up the field to add to the attack and when they add a few more it seems to be working dividends for him that free kick has gone in and over the bar and it's another score for Lizzie Casey fantastic kick of the ball by Con just growing in confidence as there's three minutes left in this first half. Aaron Griffin, two from him already. He belts another one. He clinches the fist and sends a ball out into the Aldi. Long ball is picked up there by Clancy. Jamie Malone fast hands to slip it off inside. And Jamie goes to take the return. Pirouettes around and just flashes one over the bar. That was the ball at the moment as we watch in the hands there of Oshin Hanrahan slipping it inside to Keen Meany. He has a shot at the post. It's level pegging in Park It It's not. He on the far side the pitch does well holds on to it slips it inside to Aaron Griffin bearing down on goal he's around the middle but they move it both teams have that thing of getting it out of the middle quick and getting it into the forwards inside when you look inside Griffin has done very well both Griffin's done very well and the Finucane and Patches down at the other end both Cahill's Mounsey and look at Giroud. With 31 seconds on the clock when he did it, he started and finished the move to Aaron Griffin. Level pegging once again. He's got four. It's a letting at the top of the D in towards the old scoreboard end. A chance for Currafin to respond once again. I don't think Lizzie Casey have led so far in this game and they'll need two more. If a good attack for Lizzie Casey. They have a free kick. Here it comes down at the post. Uh, Gone a bit short, it's gone off the post. Connor Fanuke and the ball hit the angle of post and crossbar. This one will have to be dealt with, and it has been in the break. They saw the attacking uh, football from Corriff in the first half, but Malone has broken inside. Here He's he goes. still going, Jamie Malone. Bearing down on goal and it's gone to the left and wide. Out came Thomas Post looking at the goal at the old scoreboard end here in the park. A nice little tidy chip over the bar from him. It's 13 points to 11. It's Currafin in front. Seven minutes gone, second half. Good score for Came back once again. Beginning just stood up there in the challenge. Has to jink around. They need somebody to come off the shoulder. That somebody is Shamo Collins. Number four on his back. Big hit put in there by Garrod Kelly. Late. Hayes will bring it clear out to Fionn Clancy. Covering every blade of grass here in Park Oak this afternoon. Connor Lean. He's met with an equal shoulder from uh, Shamo Collins and Cahill who wins that ball immediately looks up and 
finds the brother. They've done that so often in Is the back it? garden. Garo, it's been Cahal. Oh, oh. that's just gone right and wide. Garo. Out from Thomas Collins to find him. Equally brilliant kick to find Shane Griffin. And now he slips it into Aaron coming in at the angle, trying to straighten up to get the shot away. That's going to be a free in. It's the peg this one is back to the minimum again. Nobody but nobody is tuning out of this one in the final quarter. Just two points between them now. You can make that one as Conor Fanuke and tidies the side of the pitch. Lizzie Casey holding onto the ball. Cyril Sheehan has been fouled. The advantage comes. Kicking around there from Conor Meany. Finding the space. Boot to ball and ball over the bar. And rising underneath us as Aaron Griffin goes off along this left-hand channel. The hand is up for advantage. Griffin is still going. The ball has been blocked down. The referee has said that the advantage... How much of the last few years have stood to Lizzie Casey it is coming down it's Cahill into the centre it comes Keane with the chance back to Cahill oh that's outstanding defending Lizzie Casey goal Kevin Keane's jersey is nearly pulled up over his head the ball is still there on the ground he's still coming through to Malone Jamie finish to the final against Kildiceford when the late goals made the difference they've come up with another one but Shane Griffin will respond in towards Meany but a brilliant tackle put in on him by Ross Hayes and played his part brilliant tackle put in on him there though ball back to the ground they try to tidy it up and Jamie Malone slips it back to Robin Mounsey oh, yeah. what a score <laughs> from Ro- from McGrory when his angle ball found its target and it's Dermot Cahill with the free will this put four between them as he kicks it goalwards it certainly will that's an out Standing Jamie Malone coming off the shoulder. The call comes inside from Kevin Keane. He looks, takes the solo, sells the dummy, puts boots a ball and splits the posts. What a nearly, nearly cooked here now. 116 to 14. Three minutes left here to come. They're in again. Dear McCall maybe will put the seasoning on it as he takes a strike at the post and puts it over the bar. He was way back to Damien O'Locked and links up with Jamie Malone into Killian McGrory. He hits the 45 metre line. A long, high attacking ball. Oh, that's dropping over the crossbar. What a- oh, to Luke Griffin. He takes it into the 21 metre line back around.